Hey everybody, this is Tekka, and I'm going to be showing you how to use the new region protection system on the server. So this plugin is called iZone, forward slash iZone to see the information. So iZone version 7.0 created by TechGuard, that's the plugin that we are using. So getting right into it, you're going to want to get a wooden hoe to select your region, but actually before you do that you're going to want to see the commands. So Zmod is how you see the commands, so I have iZone and then all of the commands. First command I'm going to be going over is creating a new zone. Actually I'll do delete first. So let's say you already have a zone and you want to delete it. So it's simple as Zmod and um, delete Brandon's your region name, which this region is Brandon's shop. And then that's that simple. You just deleted the region. So now I'm going to select a region by left clicking down here left clicking right here and then uh, left click I mean right clicking up there so you're basically selecting a cuboid around the region um, when you do it you're gonna want to dig three down or two down so then you protect your floor as well so I'm going to right click up here to select the top of that so nobody can break anything within the little area of my home so I'm going to create the region so now it's Zmod create create and then I'm gonna call it Brandon's shop now I've created the zone Brandon's shop so if I get my wooden sword which is how I see regions and I right click any block within this zone it says the name of the zone, uh, the flags, and the owners, or the people that are allowed to build in here. So now I can do some flags. So to do flags, um, it's as simple as Zmod flag zone and flag. So I'll show you an example with the mob flag. So I can do Zmod flag, the zone name, so Brandon's shop and monsters monster and hit enter and I think I did something wrong so Zmod um, flag Brandon's shop and monster there we go so two gold no monsters flag on so now monsters won't be allowed to go in here and they won't be allowed to spawn in here so that's very helpful especially if you have like dark spaces in your building and monsters are just in your house and it's annoying you. So now if I click a block in the region it says flags protection and no monsters. So that is how you do flags. Let's go over another command. So Zmod and I can add people. That's an important one. If you want people other than just yourself to be able to build in your zone it's very simple. It's just Zmod allow your region name so Brandon's shop for me and then the person you want to add in so let's just say I want to let spirit build in here and then spirit woo has added spirit woo to the zone whitelist so now if I right click a block with my sword it says allowed owner is Brandon Hopkins and uh, spirit woo is allowed to do anything in the zone so that's how that works um, you can also M Z mod. You can also disallow people. So if you have somebody in your list and you don't want them to build there anymore, you can remove them. Uh, I'm not going to go over the expand command because I do have restrictions set on how big your zones are allowed to get. Um, if you type info, so if I go in here and type info, uh, Z mod info, and then the zone name, Brandon Shop. It is the exact same thing as right clicking with the sword. Um, if I do Zmod who, it says the people that are in the region right now, or the zone right now. And then there is Zmod list. So Zmod list, and that shows you the zones there are, the zone list. So that's about it. Um, 
If I left anything out or didn't mention anything, I will leave that in the thread below. And uh, I will set the restrictions. Well, I'll show you what the restrictions are um, below this video. So, that's about it. Have a nice day, and goodbye.